Hampshire's Commission of Inquiry into Personalisation launched a report in November 2008. Hampshire is already working on how we can put into action the recommendations from that report. With personalisation, people will have more choice and control over the services they want to support their needs. In Hampshire, we are already putting in plans in place to modernise social care services for the future. This means looking at a whole range of partners, including service users, carers, the communities that people live in, as well as key partners such as the NHS and voluntary and community sectors. The Hampshire model recommended by the Commission is about putting people first. This is not just about social care, it will cover all aspects of the County Council including transport, recreation and culture. Some of the things we want to do will require changes to national law, but in Hampshire we've decided not to wait we want to go ahead and modernise social care. Some of the things we want to do include making sure that Hampshire is a good place for vulnerable and disabled people to live. This means access to quality information and advice, access to everyday life and that little bit of help to keep people safe, well and fulfilled. What else have you got planned for today? Oh, nothing much except Urgent help for a few weeks can make a big difference to people. Helping someone to regain their independence after a hospital stay or avoiding the need to go into hospital in the first place. Self-directed support, SDS, is the name of the new process for someone to get the support and care they need. Individuals have more choice and control over how many is used for their social care and support. Yeah, I think it's vital that uh service users are more involved in organising and running services. There are some projects where service users solely run it completely on their own. And um, it, this way you know that you're going to be getting the service that you want, not something that people think you want. People who use social care services have valuable experiences and ideas about what makes for good services. We want to learn from people what they think social care should be like for the future. Carers need support with respites and various things, basically to recharge their batteries. I'm very lucky in the sense that we have 21 hours through direct payments and I have a very, very good support group called Portsmouth Disability Forum it gives me advice and other people in my situation as carers. For there to be choice, there must be things to choose from. So we want to work with people to ensure there's real choice out there in the market. Well, I think support workers are most important. These are people who will come and talk to you about the whole idea of having a support, uh, personal assistant. And they would help you go through the process, including all the tax and national insurance and those sorts of things that are seen as difficult but they're actually not. Having a personal assistant makes all the difference in the world because it's somebody that helps you do what you want to do in everyday life. There is support to help you use personal assistants in the form of support workers and they would uh, advise you on recruiting, employing, organising and paying support workers. Hampshire has a real plan for the future and we may be leading the way for other councils across the country.